Good morning. Well, today I'm going to go through my Mente Cube. It's the only one that I have separated now. I used to have Graphic 45 separated too. Now, um, in my Mente Cube, I just have my collection and then any scraps I have it here with it. And then I take all the cut aparts. And this one I actually made flags some flags and I have them in here. So I have them in these plastic sleeves and um, they're the generic sleeves from from Amazon and they are, if I can find them, um, they are not quite seven inches by almost, well, nine and a half inches. And then they have like a little flap, but I never worry about that. So then I have them alphabetical, just like my collection. And I have them in this basket. It looks like this. And so they're all in here like this. I know it's kind of hard to see, but. So all my Mente ones. And then if like I made anything else, like this one, I've got cut aparts in here. So I've got them in there for the willow and sage and um, the, like anything that I've cut the pieces, I've got those in here. And then I did the Martha Stewart and I made embellishments for that. So I've got those in here too. So anything that I've kind of cut apart and it's really nice that they're in there because if I want to know if you know, the collection is going to look good with um, the picture I have. Um, I can go there and just pull out the embellishments a little bit and kind of get a feel for the colors in the, in the collection. So this is apple season and I think I've used this twice. Um, so I've almost got the whole collection. I'll just kind of flip through it quickly. It looks like I have one of everything except for what? Except for this one here. I have two of these. So I have used it a couple times and and I have two of these. So I've used a few of the papers. Oh, I did this and then I didn't do the inside. <laughs> but Gorgeous, gorgeous collection. I love it. I love these colors. Um, the colors are just stunning. Just stunning. And so that's the Mente Apple Season. So these are all Mente. And then I've just got them divided with a piece of paper. Just. And so now I've got this. And I put the strip in here too because sometimes I'll just pull this out and make sure I have the correct one. And so this is Beauty and Bloom. And this is the cut of parts. And I, um, I don't know. I know I must have used this because I think I've used just something from every collection except for the one I'm using for my collection obsession. Yeah, I know I've used some of this. All the collections are so beautiful. I think I've used this one. No, because that there it is. Okay. Huh. Maybe I haven't used it because I think we've seen two of everything, haven't we? <laughs> I don't know. Unless I use two of the same thing, which is possible. And then next is Berrylicious. And I know I've used this a few times. And here's my scraps. And so I've got one of those left. This one left. And I know I've used one of those. left and so it looks like I've used 
like one of each. <laughs> Just, it's weird. Yeah, it looks like I've used one of each. Huh. <laughs> I wonder if I did that on purpose. <laughs> That's funny. And this, this is my biggest category of paper. You know, because I, it's the one I've got the most of, I should say. This is called Better Times. This is gorgeous. And I use this for, I know, um, the two oldest granddaughters. I know I've done pages for them with this. It's a beautiful, beautiful collection. I mean, this is a beautiful background all by itself, but you know, all the all the pages are just gorgeous. Now I know I have two of this one. Okay, and then this I've used as my collection obsession. This is Blissful Time. And I'm always amazed that when I get done, I still have a collection left. It's like, you think you'd... Now, um, I had used up um, all the embellishments, and um, so I actually ordered another cut-apart sheet and cut out more embellishments. Now, I have the same one there, and these cut-aparts, and one floral one. So I just have four pieces of that left. And I'll, hopefully I'll get through um, half of this. I should have found a way to divide it up better <laughs> ahead. Okay, this is Bloomville. Butterflies and leaves. And it looks like this. Looks like s summer or spring. All the birds, this beautiful wreath. And I think I started buying these before I started recording again. Um, looks like I have quite a bit of this left, but I know I've used this too. And this one here, I think I've only used one paper out of this, and this is Botany. Or maybe I've used two papers out of this. And I think I used them for um, Tegan being a vampire. And I'll show you the paper. I think I, well, I did use part of that. Look at that, it's so gorgeous. And part of this. Gorgeous papers. I was thinking about using that for my collection obsession, but I know I have more of the other one. So that's why I kind of chose that one. It's good to have a lot of embellishments when you start <laughs> when you start a collection obsession. Okay, and this one is called Childhood. And it seems like I've used this a lot too, but looks like there's still lots of pages left. Two. Yeah, I always feel like it, it goes a long way. Um, this one here is um, City of Love, and I use this for my oldest granddaughter's, um, one of their, I think it was a semi-formal. Well, now the formal looks kind of semi-formal because they don't wear long dresses for everything now. 
So I used some of this and I did like a balcony scene on it. And um, I would say, oh, I'll just um, link that below, but I've done so many <laughs> mint day ones, there's no way. Look at this, this is just so gorgeous. When you just like to walk up to that door and say, honey, I'm home. <laughs> Not just walk up to it, but move in. <laughs> okay, and this is Country Fair. And I don't think I've used any of this. I think I've used a little bit of the embellishments. And that's all. And I would I could use this for my recipe book too. Oh, I did use this one for um Cluck Norris and some of the little houses I think I've used in that too. Gorgeous, gorgeous papers. And I forgot that this was on, the wheel was on here. Oh, and those, I need to remember the carrots because I have Aiden in the grocery store still dressed like a carrot because he, he's worn that, um, it's like if they need to wear a costume for school, he's like, I'll wear the carrot. <laughs> he loves that thing. Okay, and this is Golden Days, and I use this for a collection obsession along with Cozy Evening because I had already used part of both of them. So I kind of put them together. So actually, I think I, yes, I have them together. Here's Golden Days and Cozy Evening. I have them both together now. And so it's just bits and pieces of them. That was one I really, well, I'd already used some, so I really kind of um, went through them. Oh, and I, I got this on sale. I forget how much they were on sale for. Maybe like 50 cents or 60 cents or something like that. So I did buy two more of these because this is my favorite and I could use it for anything because it's Hound Tooth. Hound's Tooth. So this is Cozy Evening and here's Golden Days. And I know I've used a lot of that. Oh, and I think I bought an extra one of these previously. Okay, and Dreamer. Um, Dreamer, I think, was one I had bought a couple of pieces, and then later on I was able to get a little more, maybe. Look at that. Gorgeous, gorgeous papers. Yeah, I think um, this one I just kind of pieced together as I was able to get them. And this one's Farm Life. And this one, I think I had bought like two sheets of this and then I was able to find it, so I purchased it too. I always tell my friend I live vicariously through her because she lives on a farm. <laughs> And we have just a um, shed, but we it's the shape of it's a barn. And when we were looking at houses, it, they always called them mini barns. So I said, yeah, I have a barn. <laughs> These are so cute. And I had used like um, all the embellishments out of this too. So when I was able to get the collection again, it's like I got the, you know, of course you get the embellishments, or they call them elements, with it. Gorgeous, gorgeous collection. I mean, just having the woods worth it. So, um, yeah, when, I, when I'm down to, like, nothing, it's like if one of the collections looks like it, like the cozy evening and the golden days, they look 
you know, they're both fall, so putting them together is a good idea. Now this one here, I was only able to get like two or three sheets. So I got this one with the gorgeous house. It's got the horse up here. And this side looks like this. And um, kind of like a wall. And then this one here looks, you know, like a collage sheet. And this, it's the floral. I love this. And the floral's gorgeous too. So I was able to get those two different ones. Oh, and I would totally buy this again if it came out again. In fact, if, if this came out again, I would get two because I love it. And I've almost got all the embellishments used up out of this too. And I still have tons of paper. And this is called Fall Festival. And this one I had torn for my design. And the flowers to this one is just stunning. Stunning, stunning. And I don't think I've used the flowers, have I? I don't think so. This is so cute and I've used that. And I, yeah, I have both flowers left. Yeah, it's gonna be, um, that's something I could hoard or just hang it up and look at it. <laughs> So pretty. And I haven't cut up all the yellow, or all these frames yet, so I will be cutting those out to finish the collection. And this one here, this one's called Forever Young, and it's a birthday line. And I bought one of these for my friend too, because um, I just think everyone should have one. And you know, at the price of eggs. <laughs> to buy her midday every day <laughs> so this one has you know it looks like a carnival and just awesome little birthday things and then on the side it's pretty little frames and oh I should pull over the whole collection okay and I've used this a few times too and I'll tell you this here I would like to have a whole pad of nothing but these Actually, this is kind of like that because I think on the every side, yeah, here's the two yellow. And then this one here is striped. And then on this side, it's like this, but I care less about that. This is really pretty. And then you have this one that's kind of like a, a wind of beautiful colors blow through. And then you got the candy here. But this one, this collection is worth it just for these beautiful papers. It's like, I love those. And I had them in pink and well, like all these colors were in there. Okay, and this is Graceful. And this is a collection I had like maybe one or two pieces of paper. And then I was able to find this again too. So this is one that I ended up purchasing. The full collection after I had had a couple of them. And I've used this too for different things. I've just used this one not too long ago for my second grand's um, formal or spring formal. I forget what it was. Yeah, it was spring something. So beautiful, beautiful pictures. It looks very young and fresh. It's great for teenage girl pictures. I mean, they're just gorgeous. Or this one here, I love this because it's like kitchen elements. I mean, so you could do, you could use it, do it for a recipe page. Now it's got the girl on there and that that's fine if it looks, you know, if I'm doing a Brenna page because she kind of looks like that one. <laughs> but, and I love this page, like just all those elements are so cute. So do I have two of those or did I? Maybe I didn't have those the first time. So you might have seen one of them twice because I know that I had a couple pieces and then I was able to find the whole collection. Now this one here, um, this is my collection obsession <laughs> one of these days because I actually bought two of these because it's so gorgeous. And this one is called Grandma's Attic. And I've done 
one or two pages with it. And it has the tickets, the flowers, all these really awesome elements, like turn of the century things. And now I'm upside down. Let me flip them over. Okay, so this will, should tell me where I'm at, so I'm not showing you the same thing a whole bunch of times. Just gorgeous. I love, love the colors in this. It's just so beautiful. Oh, now they're upside down again. Okay, so... Yeah, now... Um, We'll probably be at the same ones again here. Oh, now we're upside down again. Okay, did we see one of these yet? Oh, there's the tickets. <laughs> Boy, I really messed these up putting them in there. Okay, so then these must be the other kit. So I think we're through it. I think we've seen all these. Yeah. So this is my second collection. Okay, and then this is Harmony, and I just bought the one piece. Um, I wasn't really nuts about the floral, but I love this blue wood, so I got that. And This is Home for Christmas. And I think this is, I think I've just used it all. I think this is all I have left. So I have the drawers left in this, or maybe I just didn't have a whole collection of this. This might have been one I didn't have the whole collection. Because sometimes I only, um, when I seen them, because I didn't start um, seeing Minte right away. It was something that I found later. This, I love this because you know I got the ice skating kids. And then I've used this one coming up and it's called Homemade and I've used it on my second granddaughter because she's, well, both my granddaughters were very um, active crafters, but um, you know, the older one, she's. Um, boy crazy right now so she's not crafting as much as she was that and she works I remember those days <laughs> and so these are just beautiful colors look at that the colors are so pretty and I love the doors I've used some of the fence and stuff I have used the doors I guess in some things but um, I have not used the doors in this one yet. I think I've used this paper. No, nope. they're both here. I know I've used some of the elements out of here. Maybe I did not use the paper. I think I used different ones. I think I used a um, six by six when I did the one up. Okay. And this will be the last one today because otherwise it will take forever for me to load it and for you guys to look through it. So I'll continue um, tomorrow with the Mente, with the Mente project. <laughs> and I'll see you then. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.